So I wanted to film an updated stand store video. There has been a pretty big change since my last video, and that is that courses are available on every plan, not only the higher tier plan. So if you want to see everything here and how it all works, then click into my other video below. But there are two new features. The first one here is actually templates. So they ask you only use their templates if you are a stand, so stand store subscriber. Um, but they're always populating new different templates here, ebooks, things that you can use. So you do have access to this if you do pay for Stand Store. And the other big change is that you can actually create a course. So this is my Stand Store back end. This is everything I have set up. This is how it looks to people who are viewing it. However, you can see I've played around with a course here. You're going to go to add product and you can make an e-course. So I'm on the $29 a month plan. And so you do have access to everything here, which is pretty nice before you had access to everything except the e-course. So I'm going to show you how the e-course works and how it looks. There are quite a few course competitors out there like Thinkific, Jobby, Teachable, um, Member Vault, Circle. There's quite a few out there, but I think in time this will become a really good competitor. Now, the one thing I do want to say right off the bat is if you want to do things like an order bump for your course or affiliate share or what else is there? I think that's it, but those are two pretty big ones, order bumps and affiliates. So you do have to upgrade to the plan, which is $79 if you pay yearly or $99 per month. So that is kind of a feature that a lot of course platforms have. This one you will have to upgrade. However, to build a course, it's really as easy as creating something else, anything else in your stand store. So we're just going to call this test course. You can do bullets. You can add photos. You can really pull anything into this. You can link it. And then you can actually add the different modules. So module one, if it's called introduction, or I can rename it to whatever I would like, I can change what is in module one, the text, the video, and then any supporting materials, which is nice, kind of the fundamentals that you need for a course. And then I can keep adding as many modules or lessons as I need within that module as possible. And then I can click here, preview course, and this is what the course is actually going to look like. So I haven't populated anything in here, which is why it's not showing up, but it would show you the video if you have a video and then any worksheets. So this is kind of how it's going to look as a general overview. Nothing too fancy, but definitely a good option for a pretty budget course creator. And then you can see how it will look on mobile here. And then as always, you can change the thumbnail so that people can purchase it directly in your stand store, change your image, and on the checkout page, they actually pay directly on this page, which is the benefit of Standstore. You can change the image, the title, anything you want them to know that is included. And then you can actually, and this is if you, if you pay for a portion of this, you'll get here, you see like discount codes, the new quantity, all that good stuff if you do want to upgrade. Otherwise, it can be a one-time payment or you can make it a subscription if it is something like a membership. So that's pretty nice. All of this is on the lowest tier plan, except for this right here. Payment plans, also a pretty big one with courses. You can't do that unless you are on the $99 per month. But that is kind of an overview of the courses with Instan, what they have right now. I'm sure they will continue to roll out new features, but everything here you have the ability to access on the $29 per month plan. If you want a more in-depth tutorial, then head to the link below to see my initial stand store video.